So hello everyone, I want to introduce you guys to uh, my new telescope that I bought. It's uh, $34, I paid for it on Amazon and I bought it. And you can see here what it looks like, it's got all these features here. So what this is, this is an F360 over 50 millimeter telescope. What that means is 360 millimeters is the focal length. And we've got 50 millimeters here as the diameter of the front lens. So the focal length is what helps with the magnification and the front uh, the diameter of the lens is what helps gather the light. So the more millimeters you have, the more light that could be gathered in there and the more clear picture you have, right? So we've got this focal length here and what I have with me here is a F6 millimeter here you could see. Let me get that into focus. Yep, that is F6 millimeters there. And what that means is this is the diameter of the eyepiece here. It's 6 millimeters. So they say that when you're calculating magnification of a telescope, it would be the focal length of the whole telescope divided by the length of the eyepiece. So if we do 360 over 6 millimeters here, then that would give us a magnification of 60 times. So let me just put this in here. Yep, so our telescope here is now complete. We've just got to focus it at the right time. We've got our legs here. I've put some tape over the tripod and everywhere just to put all the pieces together and to make it more sturdy when you're moving the tripod. Um, I've got also another piece of equipment with me. I've got the I've got our camera here that we're going to be using to record uh, through this telescope. So we've also got our camera here, the Samsung Red camera. I've had it for quite some time. It's a really, really nice camera. It's got many features to it. And the model number of this camera is, it's got 16.3 megapixels there. Model number is, so this here is a Samsung MV900F. And uh, it's a really nice camera. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be awning our camera. We're going to be pointing the camera through the eyepiece here. And what we're, we're attempting to do using this telescope and this camera is to look at Jupiter and its moons. So I'm going to be going to a quite a clear area where Jupiter is clear. Um, I'm going to have a nice table to rest this, te uh, this telescope on. We're going to be using the telescope to aim it at Jupiter, get 60 times magnification, uh, 50 millimeters uh, of the lens in the front there, gather some light, and we're going to see Jupiter and uh, as many moons as we could possibly see. When we, when we zoom into Jupiter, we're also going to be using this focuser here to get the best focus on the shot we can. And uh, that's what we're going to do. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. So that is Jupiter there, and we're going to be looking at it through our telescope. Here you go.
So thank you everyone for watching my video. As you could see, we saw Jupiter, we saw Europa, and we saw Callisto. So we saw Jupiter and we saw two of its moons using our F360 over 50 millimeter telescope. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you guys next time.